Hi guys, welcome back to Herky the Cavalier's channel. I'm here today with Herky and Milton. And today we are testing out a new dental toy. Everybody, if you're new to her channel, welcome. My name is Mai. This is Herky. This is Milton. And if you like this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe. It really helps out our channel. So without further ado, today I want to test out a new dental product. You've probably seen this product around and I've been very curious about it, especially since February is Pet Dental Health Month. And I know you're probably not seeing this video in February, but we are technically in February right now when I'm filming the video. So uh, I posted a little reels, a shorts on YouTube about pet dental health and about reminding everybody the importance of brushing your dog's teeth. But I know it's not the reality of everybody that are gonna be able to brush their dog's teeth. So I wanted to explore a new uh, option and see if this would work out. So I've seen this around a lot and you've probably seen it too. This is the bristly um, DIY toothbrush for dogs. This is dishwasher safe. It's safe to use with dog toothpaste for strong clean teeth. This is the size small. It's beef flavored so I think it would be perfect for her and Milton. You have a toothpaste reservoir at the top. There's flavored bristles here. Uh, it's good for mental stimulation. It's natural rubbers and it's designed for your dogs to naturally put their paws at the base in order to really get a deep clean. So I'm very curious to try this out. I got a new toothpaste and I also got another branded version of this. So this is the other brand. As you can see, it's, a, it's kind of similar. I got this one on Amazon, so I thought we could compare the two. One for Herky, one for Milton, and then we're going to see how this goes. So this green thing is a bit bigger, so I think I'm going to try this one on Herky. It, it says it's eco-friendly, natural rubber. They say it's healthy. It also comes with a little brush for you to clean this, to this um, tool after because it's very important when you have uh, instruments like this to clean them well to not prevent uh, to prevent bacteria buildup and whatnot and keep it clean so let's tear this open and try it out so this is the toothpaste that i'm going to be using to try out this tool today let's see how this works out Okay, so Milton seems curious about it, which is a good sign. Okay. See this other toy. It's a bit more flexible. It's kind of softer than this one. So here's the two for comparison. This one is much softer. This one is more rigid. Let's see if Herky's curious about this one. Okay, so to try out these, I think I'm going to try one girl at a time with the device and then film all that. So, who wants to start? Herky, you going to start? Let's Stay Milton. So I'm going to put some toothpaste at the top, but it doesn't come in very easily. So let's see how Herky does with this. What you going to do with it, girl? What you going to do? Sit. Sit. Down. Yeah. So let's see if she wants to take the natural position of this toy. You're not interested? Here, 
<laughs> okay, well that was a bit of a fail. Let's see if Milton tries with the original bristly one. So already the opening here is bigger than the other one. So it can hold more toothpaste in it. And it's also easier to put the toothpaste in. Let's see. Good girl. Get it, Milton. Get it. Milton. Get it. Okay, so Herky has deserted me. She doesn't want to do the outro to this video with me. Oh, here she comes. Here, come here. Oh no, she just had to be on the floor. See, that's what I mean. Herky is much more independent than Milton. If you haven't seen one of our latest, of our previous videos, it's eight things only a Cavalier owner knows. Feel free to watch it. I'm going to link it up here and down in the description box for you. It's a very fun, lighthearted video about Cavaliers. But in conclusion, these toothbrushes do not work. So I'm kind of disappointed. I was kind of excited about them. Maybe it would work more if I keep doing it over and over again. Uh, but Herc and Milton don't seem to have interest in that texture. Uh, they're not chewers to begin with, so maybe that's why. And I'm actually surprised to see that they don't use those little stands on the sides to rest their paws on it. Milton seemed more curious, so she was already like kind of chewing it but not a lot, but she's definitely not using the two stands for her paws. So that's my conclusion. It doesn't work for her again, nothing. Maybe for other dogs it works, but if you're gonna spend your money on something for teeth brushing, I would recommend a good old toothbrush or a finger brush. Maybe that will help. You put that on your finger and you brush your dog's teeth, but these devices, unfortunately, it doesn't work. I also have a feeling that you're gonna need a lot of toothpaste to put in in those tools to make it worth your while so it's not the best health-wise to consume that much toothpaste so I would just say skip on these products. So that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If there are any other products that you would like us to try, leave them in the comments below. Uh, again, my name is Mai. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe. We love you and we'll see you soon. Bye!